Hello lovely family. Welcome and welcome back to YouTube channel. My name is Ruth. Yeah guys. I'm from the Bosho Mill. Yeah, that's my flower. Yeah. I hope you guys are doing good. I'm also doing great here. So today guys I'm really having some mixed mixed feelings mixed emotions i don't know i'm somehow happy somehow sad because of everything that is really happening in our land guys i'm born and raised here in kenya yeah as you can see the environment is super super green actually guys in my place it has been raining 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 like non-stop rains and it is really starting to become too much i know i'm not supposed to be saying that the rain is too much but then it really is guys people in my place are really dying people are dying people are dying i really don't know what you're supposed to do like right now as we talk in nairobi like in Nairobi, like the whole place in Nairobi, there is floods, floods, like the water is carrying houses, carrying everything away, carrying the cars, like every other thing that is there is being carried away by the water. Like people are dying, guys. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm just so confused. I don't know I'm so we're supposed to, to manage this kind of situation. But then it's really becoming too much. I hope we could manage it. The only person that can help us with this is only God. I don't know. We really need to pray hard. I don't know. Maybe we've done something that isn't good. Or maybe. Guys, I'm the kind of a person that believes that maybe if we do something bad, God is going to punish us like that. <sighs> Comment down below if you think. Or if you believe that if you do something wrong, God is really pun is gonna punish you. My hand is tired. Whew. So guys, that's how things is really happening in my land. If you are praying, guys, if you are praying, please remember, remember Kenya, remember my home, my land. I love this land of ours like so much and I really hate it when people are dying. Guys, nowadays in the news, it's all about death, 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 death. There is nothing good actually. Nothing is good to be honest. The news is always about Kukufa, dying, death, death, death. I'm confused. From the beginning of this year, people have been dying. People are dying, people are dying, people are dying, guys. I really don't know. I really don't understand it has been few days since the chopper crashed and it killed like 10 people yeah it was the army yeah it really killed 10 people guys I really felt for the families of the people that died guys yo I don't know I really don't know but let's go intervene Please just come and help us. If there is a way you can you can manage this kind of a situation. Come now, come, come, come. Guys, if there's something that I've never imagined in my life, is like when you worked so hard to make your life better, you're doing like anything possible to make sure that your life is best giving the best to your loved ones you're taking good care of them and then something just comes from nowhere and then destroys the whole thing like guys in just in a minute you don't have a place to call home you don't have your family members like you are all alone guys that's too much for one person like you it's really hard to take such kind of things I just pray that God is going to come in and save my land. I don't know, guys. Please pray for us. Please, please, please. Just pray for us. When you're praying, just remember us, guys. 
I don't know. I know that nothing is really impossible in God. I know it's the one that is giving us rain. Yeah. And then, we don't know why everything is really happening. He's the one that has the, the whole reason. Some things happen for the good better, for a better tomorrow maybe. We don't really understand. But then we just pray that everything goes well in our country. Pray for our government, guys. I think this year, and also last year, it has been the toughest for them, actually. So pray for them, too. Pray for our government. Yeah, and all the people that, that have undergone such kind of terror. Guys, we really don't have much. Let me just stand there. Actually, guys, I have this one. Actually, I'm going to the farmer to pick some veg for lunch and dinner. I don't want to. I'm actually going to cook the same meal for lunch and for dinner. So, I'm just going to plant the vegetables. That's going to be enough for lunch and for dinner. I don't want to cook like two times today. I just want to cook one. So, let me show you my farm and then yeah. Then guys, this is my farm. This is more of a kitchen garden. I don't know if you know this veg. Yeah. We call it Kunde here. Come here, sang it, young girl. Kanga, I didn't go soy soy, baby. Kaga kanga. And then Kanga wake say, "Go, you are going to lack we." So, guys, this is it. We call it Kunde here. What do you call it in your place? Do you even use this? Do you eat them? Yeah, this is very local in Kenya. We hit it like the most, the most, the most. I think I should show you more of my veg here. We have this one, guys. This is called Saga. And then we have this one. I don't know the name of this one. If you know the name of this one, please comment down below. Let us know. Actually, guys, my farm is not huge. It's just small. Yeah. It's really small and then we have um we have actually this place is really messy oh yeah there was something okay yeah we have this one but then like, guys i love this bed like so much i hit it like almost every day it's really my favorite but then today no i'm like no i can't eat it today and then this is saga can you see it yeah this is it then we have this guys this one is young we didn't even plant this one guys last time we had um this is actually the pumpkin leaves there was a pumpkin here i mean the pumpkin yeah there was a pumpkin and then this one grew on its own and and that one can you see that yeah so this is actually my farm guys what do you think of my farm it's very little but then I got everything I ever wanted here. You see that? Yeah. Guys, let's meet on the next one here. Right now it's late. Uh, it's almost 12 and I'm so hungry. I need to make lunch like so fast and then. Yeah, so bye guys.